kicking it off with the voice of Black Panther on Marvel's Avengers going into its fifth season. Fifth season, absolutely. Grateful to have a little staying power on the show, which is great. <laughs> a testament to the, the writing and uh, the producing team. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, congratulations with the show, and it's so fantastic. How does it feel to be voicing this character, and especially because a lot of us, you know, fellow comic book nerds, we read the comic, but you then become the voice. How does that feel? I think it's a great responsibility. Yeah. I think much like uh, T'Challa deals with uh, in balancing the, the throne, I think uh, it, it comes with uh, great responsibility, you know, uh, and, and so... I relish the opportunity. I think it's an amazing experience. I get to work with a team of great actors, great producers, great animators. Yeah. I think from top to bottom, it's just been an amazing experience. And of course, we've seen you in earlier seasons of Marvel's Avengers, but going into this fifth season, it's going to focus on you. It's Marvel's Avengers Black Panther's Quest. Can you give fans a little bit of an idea of what's in store for them? Yes, it is a bit of globe trotting uh, throughout Wakanda with uh, T'Challa and his sister Shuri. And how they have to deal with problems in Wakanda as well as threats to the world and, uh, and his allegiance to the Avengers is tested because of his responsibilities as king. So we get to see through the whole season him working that out with the assistance of, of Shuri. And, and she's amazing. Yeah. She's amazing. An amazing, amazing character. <laughs> Absolutely. How fantastic to be able to elevate it to that level. Um, and, and so when you're working on this show, uh, how did you get into voiceover acting? Uh, playing tricks on my family. Really? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and uh, and going through drive-throughs and, and having fun at drive-throughs and, and trying to you know order in different voices and and I have big uncles and so yeah. I, I tried very early on to, to find the bottom in my voice. Oh. Very very early on very and uh, <laughs> and it's just been fun you know just making fun of people and and I'm an actor first as well you there know you I, I've done Shakespeare. So I think uh, I feel well grounded in, in my uh, abilities as a thespian. There you go. Well, there's something about classical voice training that sets you up for voiceover work. And in fact, actually, you know, we talk a lot about the physical work that is required of the actors, for example, in Black Panther, the movie. But voiceover work can be really physical as well. Can you give the fans a sense of what it's like to be mm. in the booth and how you physicalize that? Yeah, I think, um, <laughs> I, I think the, the, the vocalization of, of these physicalities requires a lot of, of core work. You know, I personally hit the mountains. You know, I do a lot of running. I do a lot of uh, ab work just to have the strength to, to fight. I mean, sometimes you have to, you have to die, you know, in, in, in some cases, or at least uh, receive e extreme damage to you physically. <laughs> yeah. in which, and it's got to sound like something, yeah. you know. And, uh, and to do that over the course of four hours, which is the length of our recording session, it does require some stamina, some, yeah. some vocal stamina, certainly. Now, were you a fan of the Black Panther when you were a kid? I was not uh, a big comic book fan at all. Okay. No, I wasn't. I wasn't very aware of, of the Black Panther. I think they 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 wore us out with the mainstream heroes. You know, we, we, we had Superman, we had you know the we we had those other characters as well and and but but they kind of left uh, the panther hiding in the in the shadows a bit. Well, we're glad that you've come out of the shadows and that the fans are getting to see the face behind the voice. Have a great time here tonight at the premiere and enjoy all the love for Black Thank Panther. You. Thank you, Tamara. James. Thanks, James. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Appreciate Have it. a good time tonight. Thank you. <laughs> Marvel fans, stay tuned. This is just the beginning. Thanks so much. Nice to see you.